How's it going everybody? It's Dan from Alley back with another reaction video for you today and this time we're going to be looking at voice play once again. So hey, if you like my uh, reactions and you like voice play, you might want to think about pressing that blue and pink icon down the bottom right hand corner of the screen. It is my subscription button. Press that and notified every time that I post new content to this channel. So there's only a few things on voice plays channel that I've never listened to. Uh, one, before I started this channel, I never heard any of the uh, Nightmare Before Christmas stuff by, uh, by choice. And then I've never listened to any of the Akka Top 10 stuff. So we're going to be, we're going to be doing that. We're going to be listening to, uh, some Akka Top 10 sitcom themes today. And, uh, it, it looks like there's some spoilers in the shirts. We have, uh, Kelly Kapowski there from Saved by the Bell. We got a nice, uh, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, uh, button-up style shirt there. Jay Nunn. We got the, the squad, aka the Golden Girls. Nice, uh, nice purple T-shirt there on Earl. We have the uh, the How You Doing shirt, the friend shirt there on Jeff Castellucci, and then on Ellie we have uh, we have Gilligan himself from Gilligan's Isle. So let's just press play here. Uh, I think this is gonna be good. One. I got I got good hopes on this. Of course, you wouldn't uh, you would have done better seeing those shirts if I had brought that up. But hey, let's get to react. Again, I hate friends. I'm not gonna clap. Bass is really on point. When I wake up in the morning and the box is out of water, I'm not gonna think I'll ever make it on time. Oh, Jaina. Oh, that bass at the end there was cool. The years of the leader of the gang, life is awesome. Oh, That was really, really good. Uh, I don't know what it is about, that, about uh, the, the mix of this. I think it might be the room that they're recording in, but where, whatever it is, the acoustics is really cool. Uh, with, the, with the headphones on, it, it's giving it a really nice sound. So, so far, I gotta say, the, uh, the bass in this and uh, Lane's percussions are, this is some of, some of the coolest, uh, uh, probably some of the more fun percussions that I've heard Lane do. Um, just because there, there's something really popping out about them, I, I think just because they're they're not doing like a a real song, they're they're just doing like a medley of you know TV themes, so they're having fun with it. Um, but I will say, Jane and Ellie are really killing the vocals on this, uh, and I don't want to discount Earl either because uh, he's a uh, he was always fantastic when he was with the group. Seinfeld. Why they call it oval team? It's not noble. Number five. Making your way in the world today takes everything you got. Ooh, wouldn't you like to get away? Get away. Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. Oh, and they're always glad you came. Isn't it, isn't it something about uh, the cast of Cheers and uh, what they've all accomplished since Cheers closed? And out of all of them, Woody Harrelson is probably the, the most well-to-do, the, the most well-known of them all. I mean, I don't want to take away from John Ratzenberger or Ted Danson or even Ray, Ray Perlman because they've, they've all been doing their own thing and lots of them are still really successful today. But uh, out of all of them, Woody Harrelson is the, is the one standout star of them. Maybe, maybe, because Ted Danson's pretty good too. Good place was the bomb. All right, Philly matters. Oh, 
I love the soul in her voice. That was really fun. Um, everything about that was pretty fun. But uh, Earl's vocals on those uh, on those last couple of songs were, man, they're so good. I I miss him. It was one, you know, it's one thing losing losing Jay now. It was another thing when they lost Earl. That was that was a big hit. But they can't lose anyone else, right? That's it. If it, if Ellie ever leaves, uh, I'll, I'd actually be heartbroken if Ellie ever left the group. Anyway, that was that was really good. Uh, I loved some of those. I I always forget about Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. But that was such a fun show. I might watch that again. And I still haven't. I, I haven't watched that Netflix movie. I know what I'm doing tonight. All right, guys. So that's gonna be it for my reaction to Aka Top Ten sitcom themes from Voice Play Acapella. And if you have, well, tell me what uh, Aka Top 10 you want to see me react to next. There's a whole bunch of them, and this is the only one that I've ever watched. So, yeah. Let me know down in that comment section. That is what it is there for. And I will see you after the next reaction video. Bye-bye.